anywhere we go, we rock the place anywhere we go, anywhere we go, anywhere we go, anywhere we go. Now we're here from the fix. Salam, big up. Life is good is one of my favorite Nas albums. Shout out on that. So between the three of you, Spraga, the DJ, Salam, the producer, Jack, the selector, in addition to that extensive hip hop. <laughs> uh, that's true, you have slash is by name, to slash actor. So, yeah, all right. <laughs> Between the three of you, in addition to Bambino, extensive hip hop knowledge as well as dance or reggae knowledge. You think that gave you a distinct advantage in this clash? It was a, a strategic move by Salam. I don't think it gave an advantage because we never even played a hip hop song, if you really check it. <laughs> Which, um, hip hop, the root of hip hop is dance or is reggae. So, you know, we'll play hip hop then, because this is the root, as I say, not the fruit. So, you know, we did the thing, and we feel say, the knowledge of music itself, not just hip hop, because he's a multi genre producer, and me as an artist, so I try, I try, you know, experiment on any kind of rhythm. Give me Jack Scarpe is, a, is also a top producer as well. So, you know, the whole thing just up natural, man. I mean, the hip hop, as I, as I always say, yes. It came from here, you know. There's, there's so many things. Even when I looked at, you know, the expectation was like I was gonna fly in. There's always conversation. You're gonna fly in this person from there, and as I made a slick remark saying, uh, "So we start flying fish to give screechy." Yeah, it don't make sense. Is that, that that's what's happening? We are borrowing sand for Hellshire. That don't make no sense. At the end of the day, I looked at it, and even Buccaneer. Buccaneer is not an easy man to talk to. Buccaneer don't come out of his house and do nothing for people, but. I start bothering from last month. Actually, I, Red Rat came by me. We got so much songs we didn't play. Red Rat came by and said, I mean, FaceTime Buckingham. in. Buckingham, Salam. Oh, Jimmy, All right, cool. So what happened? And they get him out the house and get him in the suit. Ebu helped me get the string players, everything else. I just felt like there's so many parts of the culture and there's so many stars walking around on the island that sing songs that the whole world knows that nobody ever sees them. So tonight, there were a lot of people who, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, more than that. There was, tonight, there was a lot of people that kept asking me, hey, so who's your secret, this and that? And I'm sitting there going, you don't see who you're sitting around. And they didn't see who they were sitting around until they were on the stage. You know, it's always been that thing where, you know, even me going and getting dubbed from Supercat. Dub, dub, <laughs> exactly. Sitting around and, you know, getting dub play from Shaba and Supercat for this. It was a conversation. I worked with Shaba and Supercat in the early 90s. But our conversations were... 30 years long and where the perspective of is where they saw things going, it's important to me. So I just felt like we utilized Red Bull's hands to go back and give back a strength back to Scorpio, back to my brothers, back to the artists we were able to reach out to. A lot more has happened. There's a lot more will happen because it's doing for the culture. is not going anywhere. It's just me actually putting my antenna in front of it. I'm going to do some pop-up shops and some more things. And we got a lot of reggae coming, but, you know, we win. So it's the greatest part of tonight. We win. Win, right? Yeah. Are, you, are, you, are you a trophy? Yeah. Happy birthday, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. We rock the place. <laughs>